Let's test another acid. This time we will test acetic acid, commonly known as vinegar. Does it conduct? Notice that the light bulb did not grow very brightly. What does that reveal about our solution? It could be that this acetic acid solution isn't as concentrated as the hydrochloric acid solution. If there were fewer ions and it was a strong acid like HCl, it would not conduct as well. However, we can make solutions of the same concentration. Let's assume that the acetic acid solution and the hydrochloric acid solution have the same concentration. Both are 0.1 molar. For simplicity, we will represent this concentration as four molecules. Now, how do we account for the poor conductance of acetic acid? Both have four molecules of acid dissolved in water. All four HCl molecules break into ions, while only one of the acetic acid molecules breaks into ions. Of the few that dissociate, notice that the hydrogen atom that was bonded to the oxygen atom of the carboxyl group, COOH, is the one that dissociates. When the proton dissociates, an acetate ion is left behind. Acids, in which only a few molecules dissociate, are weak electrolytes and are called weak acids. 